Hey guys, welcome back for some more Hot Shots Golf Out of Bounds. In the last episode, we did the Advanced Shots Challenge Cup and unlocked Caddy Bonnie. And today, we're gonna go ahead and I think, oh that's right, I think this is literally the only course we have at the moment, so everything is at the Highland CC. So I guess let's go ahead and let's do the friendly cup because it will be the holes 10 through 18 since we did holes 1 through 9 in the last episode. And there are 30 people this time. I didn't even- I thought it was just like the same every time but I guess they do mix up the amount of people you play. So we're gonna go ahead and use Nick this time because we used Jasmine in the last episode so yeah we'll mix everybody up. Play golf. Yes, Nick, that is exactly what we are going to do, and we are going to use Bonnie as the caddy, so let's just go ahead and start the match. Are you ready? Pretty sure she's supposed to be Japanese, but they decided to give her a Scottish accent for whatever reason. Probably for the same reason that Jasmine is Japanese and has an English accent. Anyway, let's go ahead and hopefully win this tournament. It should hopefully be easy like the last one. I mean, I, it, we're in the junior rank, so it's not going to be that hard. <laughs> yeah, anyway, I'm going to use a power shot here. Although it's like crazy, I guess because of the advanced shot, the novice characters in this game actually hit pretty strong for being like, especially characters number one and two. And, alright, we got a pretty straightforward looking shot here as to if that's the case. I didn't really investigate. Aw. Had it, like, not went left, I probably could have potentially got an eagle there, but we got a birdie, so that's, like, a good way to start off the game. And yeah, we are already in first because everybody else got pars. And now it is time for hole number 11. It's pretty cool in this game. They have like just a bunch of random animations that they threw in. In my opinion, this is probably the more it, or the most advanced hot shots game. I mean, minus everybody's golf because I haven't really play played that one now that it's been out for ever. But uh Comparing this game to World Inventational, I don't know, it feels like World Inventational was stripped down. Which part of- what the hell? Part of that could be because it was for the PS Vita originally, but yeah. It's like not as advanced in my opinion. Cause like for example, they act- that was the game they got rid of the caddies running around, so they're kind of just like a little circle face now. Did you see that? I did see that cause I was the one that did that. Pretty good save right there. Or I should say, not really much of a save cause if we didn't get a birdie we'd, we would have got a par. But anyway, it is time for hole 12. And let's just, yeah, shoot pretty straight down the center right here. By the way, if my commentary sounds like shit, it's because I gotta get used to being on the microphone again, as like weird as that sounds. But like, not doing it for a while, you just have to come up with things to say. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we can get the birdie though. That was great! That was great. Yeah, we're in first still, and Julia, like, she's doing good because she was in 12th and now she's in second place. And this is par 5. That guy was like, hit it a mile, but I don't think that's gonna happen. Don't go in that sand trap! Okay good, we avoided the sand trap. And even my top driver is not going to get us quite to the green, so we're just gonna hit here and hope for the best. Good shot! Thank you, uh, Bonnie. I couldn't think of your name for a second. <laughs> even though we just unlocked you. 
I'm like so over winter by the way, random fact of the day, cause uh, looking out my window right now there's like freaking two feet of ice hanging down and it's kinda dangerous actually, but um, yeah, I hate winter. What about you people? Maybe you live in the southern states where you don't get snow and ice? Which if that's the case, y'all are lucky. <laughs> Although some people I know would rather snow, but I'm just not one of them. She like knew we were going here too and didn't even warn me. What the hell? Alright, let's like hopefully redeem ourselves here. I don't know if I used enough power there because I just seen like the yellow flash and that only means 50%. Yeah, no, this hole is going to be garbage. But it's all good, we can't do perfect on all of them. Probably still get a par though, so at the end of the day, it really wasn't that bad. Boom. Or ting, rather. You're just getting warmed up now that we're halfway through. Anyway, let's hopefully not do that in this round. <laughs> Although luckily there's no trees or anything blocking the way, but I did kind of aim towards that sand trap, but luckily he didn't hit hard enough, so I don't have to worry about that. Or, okay good, because I probably shouldn't use topspin when the wind is blowing in our face, because usually that slows it down, not that it really went that far anyway, but yeah. Okay, let's see if we can uh, maybe get a chip in here. We're close enough to the hole, but I did not pull off the backspin, so it just kept rolling. Let's see if we can get the par at least, because this was an easy shot, but sometimes I'm good at butchering those. Okay. Great. Yep. Oh, and another random thing with this game too, I know I keep pointing out all the like small things, but they, even though they do like the same animations, they say different things sometimes when you get the par, for example, or the birdie. Oh, Luckily that was just right within the range, because that almost was a bad shot right there. <laughs> Probably hit it a little too early. And luckily, too, which maybe it's just because the PS3 controller, I don't really know. Hey, aw. But uh, I seem to be able to get tap spin and side spin a lot more in this game for some reason, and I don't really understand why. But I'm gonna go with it because obviously it's a good thing. This looks like a pretty simple hole. <laughs> One of the ladies in the crowd basically had the same voice as Bonnie, like they didn't even try to disguise it. Just saying. <laughs> it looks almost downhill though, I'm kind of confused. But it went in, so whatever. And yeah, they're doing a little better this time, but uh, we're still gonna win by a lot. And some of them are like freaking level 2s and 3s and that kind of stuff too, which I don't even remember what that means or if it's even relevant or not. It might just be like an online thing that they kind of just brought in the offline mode as well. I'm sorry I made you run out of breath, Bonnie. Oh, well, Nick sounds like he's kind of out of breath too. <laughs> There's a pretty perfect shot right there. By the way, another random fact that I'm just gonna share with y'all for no reason. Well, not no reason, because this one actually is interesting. But this is the first game that they stopped making their own characters, and everybody in this game is the same in the Japanese game. So. Yeah. I think the only difference though is like they localized some of the names and like in Bonnie's case they gave her the Scottish accent but 
Stupid club. Outside of that, everybody else is the same now. I think they get more DLC than we do, at least in World Inventational. But anyway, we ended with a par, but we still got the win. And everybody else, including Mr. Pointy, who's back once again, they all managed to get plus eights and plus nines. What did the worst person do? Plus 11. All right, so they all kind of kept within each other. But yeah, another victory for me. Yes, I won. And I know these videos are a little shorter than like a lot of the Hatchet Skull videos, but let me know if that bothers you guys or not. I know in the past, like with the tennis, everybody actually preferred that. So this might be better, which actually works better for me because I can record more videos in one day. But yeah. <laughs> That's gonna be all for this one, I think. Our wait, we are promoted to level two. That's right, we gotta like claim our item and shit before I like close out. And we got the budget big air club. Cause it's not just a regular big air club, it's like a budget. That's the end of the game! Indeed, it is the end of the game, and it is also the end of the video because we're gonna end it here. So thank you everybody for watching. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll try not to, like, choke and die. And yeah, have a very good day. Bye.